Good day, fruit fans. Bo Brett here in hot and sunny Central California. We are in the midst of the hottest weather we've had all season. I've talked about how we've had a mild, comfortable year and it's really helped the fruit. But right now we've had nothing but high hundreds, 108, 109 degrees, and it doesn't look like it's gonna break for a couple more days. People always ask, what will that do to the fruit? Well, I'll tell you, it's just like you and I. We're not gonna go out and run a marathon during this weather. It's just too hot. We're gonna shut down. These trees are in the midst of a marathon right now and they're gonna do the same thing. As the temperature goes up during the day and stays warm at night, these trees are gonna hold their energy, preserve that energy to keep the tree alive and not so much ripen the fruit. Because of this temperature, conditioning also is impossible. The high, high heat during the day and overnight lows only getting into the lower 80s doesn't allow the fruit to ripen properly. So we will back off of conditioning until we do have a break in this weather. One thing I wanted to show here also is we have some color up on the ground. You can also see we've got some pruning clippings because once again, it's very important to get light. We need to get light to get color, also the sugar. Some of these later season varieties don't have the color that we did in May and June. So it's important for us to get this light. But you can still see, it's a nice looking peach. You've got some nice color. It's not that full dark red, but it still cuts very nice. And it's super sweet. It might be the middle of August, but we are not done. We're in our last push of the yellow nectarines. We'll have those for the next couple of three weeks. We have white nectarine, white peach as well to go with the yellow peach. Remember, the yellow peach will continue down to Arvin, Wheeler Ridge, where we'll have peaches into October. We hope you are being safe. We'll see you next time from the field.